Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing another tutorial using these two foursomes from ColourPop. It's ColourPop and uh, Kathleen Lights' collaboration, Where the Light Is and Where the Night Is. I used a couple of each of them to put together this really cool look. Um, it's fun, it's got a little pop of color in the middle, and it's using my two absolute favorite shades in the foursomes, which is Porter and Blaze. They're so pretty. Porter is like with this really deep burgundy maroon. It's got some sparkles in it. It's so pretty. And then Blaze is this more gold. It's got like a sheen to it. The only thing, the one thing I don't like about ColourPop is that their creamy formula, not a pressed powder or a loose powder. It's this really creamy formula and it's kind of harder to use with brushes. Um, so I end up using my fingers a lot in this tutorial. One thing I would love would be for ColourPop to come out with synth synthetic brushes that are especially made for their eyeshadows. I think that would be a really cool idea. But for now, I just use a bunch of brushes from Sonia Kashuk's uh, Target collections, which work just fine. I will link ColourPop below, Kathleen Lights' collaboration. You can get the two quads, they're $20 each, or you can get an individual pot of eyeshadow. Each of these are $5, which is a great deal. I love ColourPop so much. I'm also using this one cool product that I bought from Shop Miss A, which I already did a review on. I'll link that below as well. And I bought this uh, eyeshadow chubby pencil. It's from Clean Color. And these have been really in lately. A lot of people have been making them, but a lot of them are a little bit more expensive. This is only a dollar. It's not the greatest, I will admit, but it has really pretty sparkles in it. It's got like purple, teal, gold, and silver sparkles, which I put underneath the eyeshadows on my eyelid. So if you want to see this tutorial using where the light is and where the night is, just keep watching. So first I'm going in with Combust from my Naked Smoky Eye palette and I'm just using this as a transition color. Next I'm taking Cornelius from Where the Light Is, Kathy and Lights' ColourPop collaboration, and I'm just using a really stiff synthetic brush to work that into my crease. Using that same brush, I'm going in with Weenie from Where the Night Is, and I'm just blending that into my crease. Next, I'm using this e.l.f. palette, and I'm going to grab this really warm pinkish red color. If you don't have this exact color, that's okay. You can use a pink or a red, anything you think would look good with this look. And I'm just putting that in my crease right above weenie just to kind of create this ombre effect and then I'm going to go back in with weenie just so that sheen and a little bit of sparkle comes through. And again I'm going back in with this fluffy crease brush just to buff everything out. Now I'm using my Master Strokes Chubby Eyeshadow Pencil and I'm just applying this to my entire lid. As you can see it's a little hard to apply but I'm really just doing it to try to get those sparkles and a little bit of that darker color on my eyelids so when I put the next color on it really pops. Then I'm taking just an eyeshadow pencil and blending it out so it's not patchy. Now I'm taking Porter, one of my favorite colors from where the night is, and I'm just applying this to the inner corner of my eye, going a little bit onto the crease and then on the outer corner of my eye, creating a kind of halo effect so there's a different color in the center of my eye than there is on the inside and outside. And again, I'm just taking that same crease brush just to buff everything out so everything blends really nicely together. Now I'm taking Blaze from where the light is on my finger and I'm just putting that in the center of my eye. I'm using just a synthetic eyeshadow brush to blend Blaze out with Porter. Now we're going on the lower lash line with Porter. I'm just adding that to the inside of my lower lash line and also on the outside.
Now I'm using Blaze on the center of my lower lash line and I actually found that it was a lot easier to do this also with your finger. To highlight underneath my eyebrows, I'm using Glow from where the light is and I'm also going to be using 13 for my Urban Decay Smoky Palette. Now I'm just lining my waterline with a black eyeliner and I'm going to be curling my eyelashes and using my e.l.f. 3-in-1 mascara for my top lashes. I'm using my Benefits Roller Lash Mascara for my bottom lashes because the brush is a lot easier and smaller to do for your bottom lashes. I hope you guys liked this tutorial. I absolutely love ColourPop. If you want to see any other tutorials, please leave me a comment below. Also, be sure to subscribe to my blog and my YouTube channel if you haven't already. See you later!